Hello everyone, it's me. Look what we have today. We have the OMG Dance Dance Dance. OMG girls, all four of the brand new OMG dolls, whoop de doo Channel five, six, all seven, and eight. So who is getting an OMG sister this round? We have Miss Royale, Major Lady, B-Girl, and Virtuelle. Looks like we get to grow our VR cutie family. Oh, and I almost forgot, we also got the LOL Surprise Dance Balls. Speaking of forgetting, we don't want to forget the brand new dance machine. So all of these were sent to us by MGA Entertainment for free. A special thank you to them. Let's start off with Channel 5, Miss Royale. Hey, wait oh. a second. Royal Heine, what are you doing here? I know you're not about to unbox brand new sisters without inviting me, potentially my sister. Oh, no, I, nope, nope. I did invite you guys. I sent an invitation. Sure. Oh, good. Okay, fine. I was going to tell you later. See, I knew it. You better hope it's not my sister. Otherwise, I'm going to be so angry that you didn't invite me. Uh-oh, looks like I'm in trouble because uh, that's Miss Royale. And I think that is Royal Heine's sister. Hey, it's, hey, is this my sister? She's got, she's got two-toned eyes like me. And she looks like a superhero. Hey, I didn't get an invite. I think that's, that's my sister, right? I really hope I get a big sister. She's so pretty. I hope she could do my hair like that. Hang on a second. Forget the little kids. I want to know whose idea it was to bring another sister to the family. She better not be taking my Joy-Cons. Mom and Dad need to invest in a brand new Joy-Con for her because I'm not sharing mine. Well, is it real? What is it? It looks like a box with a coil on it. Hey, she copied my style though. Is, is that another pixie sister? Okay, so all of the LOLs have their suspicions. Let's just get the girls out and, and calm all of them down. Here we go with channel five, Miss Royale. Let's check out the side of the box. Miss Royale, really pretty. I actually really like the boxes. And the fact that they're dual chrome, like multi-chrome colors, they have a really cool color shift going on. I don't know if this is supposed to be like a game, like a Game Boy type of old school game, or if it's supposed to be some type of phone, but it's pretty cute. And on the side here, we have all the girls in retro TVs. They've got a color of their own for each of their screens. Let's check out the back. What do we got here? Oh, it's a TV guide. Whoa, they're going real old school guide. What to watch? My show's pretty neat. We have channel five, six, seven, and eight, and the programs that they'll be showing at seven, seven thirty, eight, eight thirty. Let's take off the little sleep. On the back here, we have a little arrow. Are we supposed to slide this out? Oh, that was easy. Sweet, we didn't have to, wow, her hair color. They did not wait on any of the surprises. How cool is that? And we do have magic black light surprises. 15 surprises, unbox fashions, dress me, shine bright. This part of the box, I thought I would at least have to open this part of the box. It's perforated, so let's remove that. Oh, wait, that just totally fell off. Okay, maybe I don't know anything about unboxing because apparently I think I did it wrong. Okay, so uh, maybe we can make her dance. It has a little arrow here. Oh yeah, you can make her dance. You move it back and forth and she does her dance moves. Is she voguing? Yes, she is. But yeah, I like how easy you can unbox these and not have to cut through a whole bunch of plastic to get to her. Hey, she's got that caged whatever this is called. I would call it a petticoat, but it's not a petticoat. So, first impressions. What do you guys think of Miss Royale? She does look pretty royal. She has a mixed match fashion. It reminds me of the OMG light style. We have her fashion magazine, Fashion a la Pose. Let's take a look in here first. Oh, it's not just a fashion magazine. It teaches you how to dance like her. Step one, step two, and step three. And over here, we got her voguing. Ooh, check out her back background me likes let them dance i really want to make a wall like this for my dolls so we have a bottom piece over here that we can put into the background area and she has nice flooring to stand on here is her doll stand oh and look they've got two waistbands for the wider waist and the smaller waist of the dolls because they have omg boys now well they have one boy i'm sure they're going to be working on more let's get our doll stand in check 
plug it right in. She's got so many waistbands. So we've got one, two, and three. We also get a set of instructions. Yep, see, it says times three for the little waist clasps. You know what else I noticed with her? Her hair is a completely different texture from any OMG doll so far. It's almost like they used yarn for her hair. I'm sure it'll be so pretty once you get these little braids out if you wanna do a different hairstyle for her. I'm also loving the color of her hair. Here is her cute little outfit with all the bows and the mixed colors in there and her knee-high socks plus her cute platform heels. She also has a little heart on the side of her cheek like her little sister. Yeah, we're twinsies. Her outfit is a two-piece crop top and a skirt. This part has a clasp that you can undo and take off if you want. She's got painted on bows on the back of her socks and white little bows on the back of her heels. And her nails also match the trim on her sleeves and socks and her eyeshadow. So for her extra outfit, Outfit. Let's see what we have. Oh, cute, a matching skirt. So if you wanna take out that little caged skirt, you can put this one on. Next up, we've got her shoe box or her hat box. What have we got in here? This feels pretty big. Ooh, yeah, she can't be complete without her fan, her very fancy fan. And on the back, it says extra. What else? She has several other accessories, little bowed earrings, and a broken heart choker, plus her black light. Now I'm gonna turn off the lights for her black light magic surprise. Here it is, you can see that she has a mask and her hair color changes. Everything glows just a little brighter. I am using a much bigger black light so you guys can see it much better because the black light they give is a little small and things are just a little bit harder to see, but you can still see them. I just wanna use the bigger one so you can get a better idea of what it looks like. So there she is, she totally lights up. Her hair turns light blue, she's got a mask on. Everything just lights up on her. And there are her shoes. Oh, okay, so she's got white and pink in the black light. That is pretty neat. Let's turn her around to see what the back of her socks looks like. Okay, so the back of her socks didn't change much. And here she is with her other skirt and her fan. In the black light, you can really see the hashtag extra on her fan. along with her accessories comes a brush. Next on our TV guide, we're moving on to channel six, Major Lady. Let's have her do her little dance. So she's standing straight here and then she's moving her arms. Yeah, so we can slightly move it like this, but yeah, mm -hmm. now it's working. There you go. And let's grab her on out. Here she is. She has fiery phoenix orange hair. Major lady, dance, BB, dance. Fly, BB, fly. I like her eye makeup, very pretty. And her lip color looks very nice with her eyebrows. Oh, she's even got glittery eyebrows. And she's got matching nail polish. Let's take a look at her background. Oh, she's a disco babe. Mm-hmm, yep. I knew her outfit kind of looked a little bit on the 70s side, maybe like a, the disco age. I, I don't know. Her dance floor is glittery red. She gets a silver doll stand. And here's her dance guide. She teaches you how to dance, groovy style. And here is a full look at her outfit before we try on anything else. Look at her groovy boots. They are so psychedelic. So she comes with a matching brush. And let's see her extra outfit piece. Ah, it's her little cape. She's got a silver cape. Mm-hmm. It is very sparkly. And on the back, we've got a lightning bolt. Inside her box, we have her star belt, star glasses, in case you were doubting that she's a superstar. Oh, and here goes a whole bunch of other accessories and her black light. A set of earrings, one's a lightning bolt and the other is stars, and she also has a bracelet. Her little cape actually has clear elastics that you can put her arms through by taking off her hands making sure not to break her hand. There you go, get it through the elastic. That way, she could really do the phoenix. Whoa, there she goes, our fiery phoenix. That hair is glowing. I don't know if you guys can see how much brighter she is with the black light. It looks like her hair is a ball of flames. And she even has a lightning bolt in her eye. Okay, I don't see anything else that stands out super duper much, except for her shoes. Yeah, that stands out a lot. That is some bright orange shoes. On channel seven, we have B-Girl, which I think is Fresh's sister. So let's see what her dance moves are. 
I think all the girls represent a different genre of music. So hers might be R&B, hip hop. Major ladies might be disco music. Miss Royale's might be classical music or pop music. And Virtuelle's might be techno music. Carefully get the perforated edges off. And there she is. What dance moves is she doing? Okay, I saw movement. Let's push it back in, see what else she does. Oh, she is so pretty. Painted on edges and her hairstyle and just her face is just so pretty. I love the face paint with the black lipstick and her outfit. Everything about her is super cute. Anyways, let's check out the background. Oh, she's in her apartment in the city. Hey, she might just be in her studio, not just her apartment. Yeah, she's got a dance floor studio floor on the bottom. So looking underneath her outfit, she has a separate piece, like a separate underwear. And yeah, here are her soccer cleats. <laughs> just kidding, she has heels. Take a look at her hair. I love the braids that they did on her. They're so clean and I love the silver in her hair with the black, very shiny. And I just love the way they painted the edges. Very eye-catching. I love the baby hairs. And she's got a little bit of face paint on the right with silver eyeshadow. Her nail polish is silver and white and her doll stand is white. She comes with a silver brush. Let's check out her dance pamphlet, her dance guide. B-girl, power moves, break it down. So here are her power moves. She has a holographic puffer jacket. Oh, that is some good quality clothing, whoa. She's got lining on the inside of her jacket with LOL OMG in strips down the front. And on the inside it says drop, jump, all kinds of words in graffiti. I really like her jacket actually. This is some detailed handiwork. Let's check out what she has in here. Okay, jewelry and some glasses. She gets hoop earrings. And here is her black light. Let's get her hoop earrings on. Oh, that pulls her look together so nicely. Let me make sure not to mess up her hair with the glasses. Get her jacket on. And here she is, all dressed up. I really think she's so decked out and so detailed. And uh, she actually looks like a high-end doll, despite the fact that she doesn't have a lot of accessories in comparison with the other dolls. Here she is, what is it? Oh, her baby hairs change colors. And look what she has on her face. Okay, I'm gonna take this off. She has KO on her cheek. Her baby hairs change into a light blue glowing color. So does the rest of her hair. And the inside of her jacket glows orange. And finally, here we go with Virtual Channel 8 special. What does Virtuelle do? Here she is. Kind of looks like she's gonna do a skip hop. All right, let's get Virtuelle out. Nice and smooth. Ooh, she's got pixelated makeup, hello. She's got the same game controller plus sign in her eyes, just like her little sister, but she's got the pixels on the side of her eyes and the pixelated eye makeup. Oh, does she even have pixelated eyebrows? Whoa, she is detailed. She's got a lot going on. Extra, and are those, what are these? Oh, these are her pockets. They have zips on the bottom as trim, and she's got the pants to go over her pixelated shorts plus matching boots loading a virtual robot grooving fashion glow oh i like her pixelated heart earrings well then she's actually quite different from our omg diy but they kind of look like twinsies i mean the color combos and everything go together you can tell they're sisters yeah i guess i like her style i want my hair in braids too now maybe i'll go do them today what about her background? Oh, I have a feeling this is gonna be so pretty. Whoa, where is she at? That is just the coolest. Looks like she's in Times Square. It's all pixelated and there's a lot of TV displays going on. Also live music. I love the color theme. Her background is awesome. Here is the bottom half of the background. Here are her dance moves. Oh, she's doing the robot. That's hilarious. So here she is out of the box. She's got box braids all over and she even has some pieces of her hair that is braided with light pink and it makes it look like pixels. That's a pretty cool touch right there. Are these box braids or are these twisty? Okay, okay, so some of it's braided and some of it's twisted. So these hot pink parts are just twisted. She also has 
Oh, a pair of socks underneath. Really cool, they look like switchboards. I really like her boots. Her boots are really cute. I think her and Pixel can actually share these. These are really nice with the outfit. Only thing I wish they did was add a little bit of edges for her too. Maybe not as much as B-Girls, but just a little bit would make a whole lot of a difference. I'm probably gonna do that to mine because I like customizing my OMG dolls. Even if I'm not customizing them all the way, I like kind of doing my own little thing with the ones I have, the original ones. Kind of like I did here with Da Boss. I changed up her eye makeup. I added some more details to her eye color, changed up her lip color, and gave her some more blush. So pretty. Ah! Excuse me? Oh, hi. I was just saying, your makeup's so pretty. Oh, thanks. She gets a gunmetal doll stand. It's like a silvery black. It's a neon yellow brush. And what are her extra outfit pieces? She gets a jacket. Oh, look at the fabric on her sleeves, cool. What does the back say? There's nothing on the back. Here are the rest of her things. Is this like a visor or is it? Oh, look, it's got like a switchboard, motherboard, computer stuff going on. I don't think these are VR glasses, but actually they could be VR glasses. They have to be. She's Pixel Sister Virtual. Here's her light. Any more? Oh, yeah, those little earrings. Pixelated things are so cute. Look how cute those earrings are. She's already pop, lock, and dropping the robot on us. Big sister, teach me the robot. I want to warn your ways. And here she is with her black light surprises. Whoa, she is like a glow ball. She is glowing everywhere. From her hair, to her individual braids, to her shoes. Now next up, we have the dance machine. It's the brand new LOL car, three in one. You've got a car, pool, and dance floor. Plus, you get an exclusive doll, this little dance bot. Features include an exclusive doll, surprise pool, dance floor, black light, headlights, and adjustable seats. Whoa, check that out. You could even fit an OMG doll in there. You've got a glove compartment and fold out mirrors, and you can see all of the features in action. So the stuff comes in this little gas pump box. Here is Dance Bot, our exclusive little black light doll from the LOL Light series. Love the color theme on this new one. And here is the other items, all in paper bags. Watermelon, anyone? So this one's pretty big. Let's open this one first. Here's seat number one. And this should be seat number two. Yep, the car keys. Water bottle. Oh my God, Dance Bot's got a driver's license. So cute. And this is actually a sticker. Here are Dance Bot's glasses, her tiny little bracelets. But wait, there's more. What have we here? I think that's like a little waistband that you could put. Yep. Or no, 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 it's, it's a cup holder that you could put on the side of the car. I remember that from the first car. Let's get everything in the car. The seats, they should click into place. So here's the back of the car where we can flip open and it turns into a dance floor and a pool. Here's the pool and we can also do it like this to make an extension to the dance floor. Then you can place this right over here for when our dolls need a water bottle. The keys actually go into the car, but it doesn't really do anything. So it's for decoration. The wheel actually turns and the gear shifter is what turns the lights on and off. The car doesn't come with its own battery, so you're gonna need three AAA batteries. You can also close the lights by pressing them down and press them to open them back up. The black light on the car is what you could use to see Dance Bot's black light magic. You could place it right in front of the car and turn on the black light to reveal her surprise. If you can't really see her surprise with the light on the car, then you could always use the light that comes with your OMG dolls. Or I'm gonna use the black light I bought on Amazon where you can see things a whole lot better. And the back of her head. I've got her bracelets on and her glasses. Here are the adjustable seat belts. You can take them off all the way, just like that. And since we have B-Girl on the cover, let's have her sit in the car. Oh my God. And we can have Fresh hang out in the back. Now let's get into these dance series balls. Here's our little cover girl. Supplies doll. Here goes our power outlet. Kind of looks like a face. And our zipper is a game controller. We've got eight surprises. Here's another little baby. I grow. 
Here goes the second layer. Kind of looks like the... Yeah, that's green. The balls look familiar. They look like the Lights series balls. The zips hardly ever work for me, guys. So I just, just, I avoid the zips. A bunch, a bunch, a big wad of bags to get into. Here is the collector's guide. And what is this? Dance, dance, dance. Oh, cool. It's a little holographic card with the dances. You just move it here and there. How about you guys try this dance right now? Here is the collector's guide. What have we got? A giant poster of the cute little babies. Oh, I like this one. I like her eyelashes. Oh, this one's cute too. They're all cute. And we don't have as many. I remember in the beginnings, OMG, we had so many lol dolls in each of the series like series three it was so many dolls but now we're winding down to the smaller series on channel five we've got phenom bb radio queen bay wheels oh and radio queen is versing bay wheels oh okay and then on channel six we've got tempo cutie and then Chica Chica is versing Rumba Girl. I like Chica Chica, she's so colorful. Channel seven is Turnstep BB. Then we've got Rhythm Empress versus Freestyle. Channel eight is MC Pose. Then Revue versus Tablet. And everything's changed here. We've got MC, Microphone slash Rap. And we've got Old School and New School. So those are the little signs. You know what's missing? There's no rare or ultra rare, none of that. I actually liked it when they didn't tell us what the surprise is, but you know for the past couple series they've been telling us what the surprise is with the water surprise okay let's see who we've got first doll uh, get some microphone some soda pop a oh, a stand um another stand i think this go nope that doesn't seem right. That looks like a little alien. And do we have another stand? Whoa, cool, look at that. So does this go in here and our doll can move on it? How does that work? I think that's how it goes. But then how does this fit on here? Oh, like that. And then you put the little doll stand in there and your doll can move and it looks like they're dancing on spirals. Can you guys hear that? What is in here? Oh, the black light. We're gonna get it working. And a little disco ball bag. Here are the little shoes. And the outfit. We've got a top and a bottom. So let's finally get our little doll out. Who did we get? She's got orange hair, totally matches her outfit. Oh, we've got Tempo Cutie, and she is the MC. Look at her dance. Unfortunately, Tempo Cutie is a tinkler. Spell me, please spell me. Okay, fine. So here she is all dressed up. She's looking absolutely adorable. And she is the MC, that's why she has a mic. Let's make her dance. Oh, wait, what? Let's spin and make her dance. Oh wait, actually that's not how, oh, there you go, yeah. And for her black light, magical surprise. You can't really see anything. That's why it has to be a dark room. Let's open up the other one. Then we'll do the black light surprise together. So from channel six, we've got Tempo Cutie. Different color ball. Pop it open. And let's see if that little holographic card changes for the different balls. Oh yeah, it does. We're doing a different dance here. Oh, the stands are different colors and the green definitely makes it look like a little alien. Hey, did I get the little boy, Phenom BB? Here is a wristband or a bracelet, water bottle, and pom-pom shoes. <gasps> I think I know who I got. Here's the little stand, black light, Whoa, here's her headpiece. That is a unique headpiece. Totally new for LOL. And finally our little dolly. She's got her hair in cornrows and she has hoop earrings. Let's try out her headpiece. Oh, it's, it goes flat on her head. Unless we kind of do it like that so we can get the height that she has in her drawing. Yeah, there you go. Whoa, wait a second. Okay. So does this mean that Chica Chica has a black light surprise, but the ones that don't have a light don't have a black light surprise? Hmm. Only Bay Wheels and Chica Chica have a black light surprise. I mean, those are the only two with the little light bulb. Okay, so before I put her outfit on, because I see she's got something going on, let's get the black light on her. Oh cool, she's got like a little bikini on with leaves. It's like a leaf print. 
Anything on her face? Nope, nothing on her face. I really like how they have doll stands now, so you can stand your little LOLs. Let's check if she has any black light surprises on her outfit. Yeah, no, it was only underneath her outfit. And what about Tempo Cutie? I mean, I think she would glow, but she doesn't have that black light surprise that Chica Chica had underneath her outfit. At least I didn't see anything. Yeah, there's nothing on there. And according to the collector's guide, they both are tinklers, so we will spare them. So, what do you guys think of the brand new car and our brand new Dance Dance OMGs? Plus the brand new little Dance 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 series. Let me know on Instagram. Again, thanks to MGA Entertainment for sending these in for free for us to take a look at on the show. That is it for now. Until next time, I will see you guys later. Bye!